We're sitting with George Ross here, Donald Trump's uh, right-hand man, and coach. Yes. And, and coach. coach. Well, not a coach, but an advisor. Okay. You could call him a coach. I don't think Donald would like me being a coach. But a personal advisor. Definitely. And you have been for many years now. Many, many years. Yeah. Uh, as we discussed, we're in the business of ensuring that uh, people stand an above average chance and will get to retirement safely, securely, and profitably. Um, if they can't, we tell them they won't be able to. How important do you regard coaching and financial planning in the run-up to and during retirement? Oh, I think that that's a major, major, major factor. Yeah. And I think that many people who have, who have money and have accumulated money don't, go and don't get a financial planner to, to figure out where they're going to be when they want to be there. Mm. And I think that's a major, major mistake on their part. Mm. And I know that uh, recently, I, uh, the last few years, I went into a, to a I started with a major financial planner to do to see where I was going to be, how much money I needed to live e on, even and you. where it was. Oh, me, definitely me. Yeah. And we set up a whole, whole plan. Right. And say, good. Where do you want to? Where do you want to be? When? And how much money do you need to live on? And what's your lifestyle? And how much you want to leave to your children? How much you're going to have to pay in taxes? What's the best thing to do? To in your future retirement. Mm -hmm. It was wonderful and very enlightening and something that I certainly did and would highly recommend because most people say, I won't have enough money to last me for my life. Well, if you don't know how much you need, how are you ever going to figure it out? In your case, out? you will, though. In your case, you will. Yeah, my case, will. yeah. I'm, I'm, but you I'm still fine. got financial planning. Oh, no, my case was not yeah. a problem. Yeah. But I say, and I found out after doing financial planning that I got a lot of money I can never use myself or will never choose to use myself. What do you do with it? I say, well, let's give it to charity. Yeah. But if somebody said, would you give 400000 a year to charity, and they asked me and I didn't know what my finances were, be I'd say, sure. what do you mean? Where am I going to get the 400000 mm -hmm. But after financial planning, said, well, you've got it. Mm -hmm. Every year, you've got at least that amount left over. And then we went all through the whole thing, and I said, gee, I didn't know that. Yeah. So the financial planning was good, and now I can give back money that I didn't know I had. Yeah. And that's taking care of my wife, my children, insurance and taxes and whatever else mm. and without a good financial planner you're way way behind the, uh, the eight yeah. ball. terrible you know? so by highly recommended mm. any good company and any person should have a financial planner when they're reaching their retirement years or if they're even thinking of it and you know what happens the years go by very fast yes this, you think at this point i got plenty of time you don't yeah and it, before you figure well it'll take me five years it's probably going to take you 20. And it's gone before you know it. And then all of a sudden they say, I don't have enough money to last me the rest of my life. Yes. But they don't know. How much do you need? What do you need? What's your lifestyle? And that's what a good financial planner can do. You have insurance. You have pension funds. You have everything. You put it all together and, and say, this is what I've got. What do I do? If I can just add, George is 85 years old. Right. He doesn't need to work. He stayed so young because he still does work. That's right. He works four days out of seven days. And, uh, yeah, thanks very much for this. You're welcome. But uh, boy, I think you've got a wonderful uh, practice, something mm -hmm. which is very much in demand. And if anybody doesn't use your services, it's their mistake mm -hmm. because it's the way of the world. And uh, important to figure out where you are at a point in time and where you want to be at a point in time and you have a goal and figure out whether the goal is realistic. Right. And uh, if you do that, then and it gives you a certain peace of mind. Yeah. You don't have to worry anymore and say, I, I won't have enough money when I retire, or I don't have money for this. You don't know what it is that you, you'd be planning on doing. So you put it all together and say, this is what I'm doing, this is what I want. And Gives you a strategy. Absolutely, and you should have a yeah. plan. Everybody should have a plan for their life. George, thanks very much. You're welcome. Good, good luck.